This fight is not just right and left. This fight is a Republican Democrat. This fight is good and evil. These, these policies are putting out are putting everyone at risk, regardless of who you are. And one of the beautiful things about California and about Southern California is that we are an all-inclusive state. Everyone can step up and everyone can put in for their community, regardless of where they come from, what they look like, who they're about. And one of the guys I'm going to bring up here, I saw his guy from day one standing out there uh, waving the flag of freedom and calling for these mandates to end. Yes, I'm My man, Mario Prezet! Hi everyone, my name is Mario Presents. Um, I come from Palmdale. How many of you guys have heard of Palmdale? All right, so I want to tell you guys something that we did in Palmdale. I can't take all the credit. I'm a content creator. I'm one person, but we can't do this on our own, which is why we're here. In Palmdale, we passed an ordinance, 1577, outlawing the mandated vaccines, the mandated passports, third-party sharing of our private medical information, yeah. and mandated testing for employees. In 30 days, if any business dares to ask for a passport, dares to make an employee test for COVID antibodies, they will lose their business license. Yeah. Oh, you can't hear? We couldn't have done this on our own. We were out there every day, every night. We formed a group of people just like what you have here. I encourage you to know your neighbors, introduce yourself to your neighbors, share your phone number with your neighbors because these people are going to support you. That's what we did. We built a support network and we were out there making signs at the brewery at, on Thursdays with our kids. Okay, I don't have kids, but I'm out here in this fight for your kids. We have people out there making signs for their kids, with their kids, and then we have another team out there posting signs on the streets because I love the F you Joe Biden sign, but I absolutely love the no mass, no mandates, no force vaccines. Why? Because someone wrote that. Someone sees that and it draws your attention. Taxation without representation is great, but vaccines kill draws my eye and I want to see that on every corner. That is how we promoted our message, letting people know we were in the community and we held weekly meetings to say, this is where we are, this is where we're going. So when people wondered, hey, I heard about this, this coalition as I was driving by, what's it all about? Are you a new member? Yes, you are, yes! It's about being fun. We want to engage the community. We want the community to also engage with us. When the news and the mainstream media called us violent extremists and says the opposition doesn't want to show up to city council meetings because they're afraid of getting beat up, we said, you know what, we're going to write our own news story. We wrote an entire newspaper and we are already working and producing our second edition of this newspaper because we want to write our own story. The media does not write our story, we do. So I encourage you guys to find groups in your community. Join a group in your community. The leaders of your groups, organize your people so that you guys have an effective, uh, uh, effective game plan. Do not forget God above all else. And I cannot stress this enough. I may stand here in heels and a rainbow flag, but God is at the center of everything we do. What we did in Palmdale could not happen without the grace and the blessing of God. We had a man drive through our protest and by the grace of God, the woman was not seriously injured. We had a 5-0 victory, unexpected. Why? Because he guided us the entire way. If you want a copy of the Palmdale Journal, come see me. I've got plenty of editions and I've, every time you see me in a rally, I will have brand new editions of the Palmdale Journal and it is our hope that we have a Palmdale Journal, a Torrens Journal, a Santa Clarita Journal, a journal in every community writing your story. So again, in conclusion, I just want you guys to thank you for being here. Thank you for supporting this movement. Thank you for standing up for freedom because some of us, we can't be out here. We can't be bold. So we're bold for them. All right, guys. Thank you so much. Thank you, Mario. All right. I love it. Somebody else standing up for freedom and doing something about it, right?